Hello everyone, today we're going to learn how to split up SATs in a UTXO. So you want to use this to uh, send out a specific amount of SATs. So let's say you have 2000 Nakamoto SATs in a UTXO and you want to send someone 500. You're going to need to use this method in order to send out the 500 and still keep the 1500 left over uh, without spending them in fees or losing them. So uh, let's get into that. Okay, so now what I'm going to show in this video is me splitting up these 2000 Nakamoto sets. So I want to send 500 Nakamoto sets to this wallet and then have the leftover sets in here. So at the end, I should have 1500 Nakamoto sets here and 500 Nakamoto sets here. So let's first uh, set up the transaction. So we want to go to our UTXO tab and make sure everything else is frozen so we don't accidentally send those sats. We only want our change wallet um, for the fees and then our sats that we want to send. So we can click on control and select both of them. Click on send sats. Uh, before we go into this direction action, let me just show you that those are actually um, sats. So we can go and check in setting and then there we go. We actually have uh, 2000 sats in this wallet and there should be Nakamoto sats. So let's say pay to this wall over here. So we just play copy address, go back, send. Let's label this one. And we want to send out 500 Nakamoto sats. So we type in 500 and remember we want to get the small circle to be in the top so both so just uh click around and then there we go so the first part is done so right now we are going to be sending out 500 nakamoto sats to this wallet but we want to send the leftover sats to uh, another wallet so we click this add button for another transaction that we can add so we're actually just going to send it back in the wallet that's actually holding the 2000 sat. So we can just copy this address and go back to send. And we want to label this uh, to. So the second part of the transaction, and since we're sending out 2000 sats total, uh, the first one is 500. This one should be 1500. So you want to send out the, the total amount of sats. So if you only want to send out 500, then you have to send the, the change, uh, whatever that number is to another wallet. So you don't lose anything in fees. Okay. So right now this is correct. So we have sets from our UTXO with the Nakamoto uh, being sent out and we have 500 sets for this wallet and then 1500 sets for the other wallet. And you can see the importance of labeling. So now this is actually the correct order. So we have one and two. And once we press click a transaction, we, sh we want to see the same order. Okay, so we got lucky this time. Sometimes the order is gonna move around. So you have to click out and then retry again until you actually get the one and two order. So this one is actually correct. So we have our Nakamoto sets on the top left. Do you see the small circle? And then we can see the two smart circles, uh, the UTXO being sent out. Um, and we have our change wallet paying the fees. So this is correct. And let's go sign it. We would click sign and broadcast the transaction. Okay, so now let's just wait for our transaction to go through. And then I'll come back and verify that we actually did it correctly. Okay. Our transaction just completed. So now let's check if we actually did it correctly. So let's go to my wallet. Let's first check uh, these 500 sets that we sent. So we can go to setting. Then you can see down here. And we have, yep, there's 500 uh, sets here. We can click on it and they're block 286. So we did that correctly. So let's go back and see the, these 1500 sets that we sent back. And let's see. And these are also correct. 
So now we done our successful uh, transaction. We split up our UTXO. Uh, you can add more uh, to it. So remember that you can always add multiple transactions. You just have to make sure that you label it uh, just one, two, three, four. Uh, so that's easy and you want them to be in order because uh, if they mess, if they're in different orders, then the transaction can mess up and you might be sending to like the wrong wallets and you don't want that. So hopefully um, you learned how to send these transactions. If you need help, you can always join uh, the Satoshi Dijin Discord and you can just ping someone and we can uh, help you out with that too. So thank you for watching and have a good one.